you know, with the way we're running the football, and then if we get our passing game going when we do, uh, that's going to be really hard to stop us. It is all about the wins. The Seahawks have now won three straight games, and Russell Wilson, Warren, certainly impressive on the ground, yes. but through the air, not accurate again. What's going on with the quarterback? Well, I think Russell's kind of going through a readjustment in the passing game right now. You got to remember, Percy Harvin was a big part of what they wanted to do in the passing game. Now that he's gone, they've kind of retooled the passing game. They're playing two young guys, two rookies, uh, in that in that pass offense, and Paul Richardson and also Kevin Norwood. Guys that have done a nice job so far in catching the football, but they're not always in the right position that they're supposed to be, and that's going to happen with the young guys. You look at the first interception Russell Wilson threw, he threw the ball more to the inside where uh, Richardson went to the outside. That little bit of communication causes a turnover. So Russell's going through that adjustment period with these young guys, but they're all talented. I think they're going to be good players down the road. And, and the more experience they get, the better they're going to be towards the end of the season. So we just have to be patient with this passing game as it kind of catches up with the rest of the offense. And if the Seahawks continue running the ball like they have, I guess that's not so much of a concern as we take you now to the second half against the Giants where the Hawks really poured it on. Hey, 
It's a trip to Kansas City. A look ahead is on the way. But not before we take an unscheduled flight around Century Lane Field where the Hawks go wild. Not really emotional, just interesting. Hang on the poor guy's head. He loves 